midterms out of the way I want to keep making more videos for you guys like fashion videos I want to focus more on fashion more than like vlogs because I don't really do exciting things I, I'm more interested in like fashion and stuff so first thing I want to show you guys is this North Face jacket that we got Chris actually, this is actually Chris's, but I mean, we share all of our clothes, so we bought this one. It's North Face, so it's like really warm, and it's a little oversized for me. It fits Chris a little bit big, but I, we like oversized stuff, so um, I believe it was only like $30, and these go for like $60 to $120. Next thing I'm going to show you guys is this. Oregon Ducks crew neck. I got it because I really like the yellow, um, the yellow letters. I feel like red, yellow, blue, all of those colors are in season right now, especially for spring. I got it at Community Thrift, and Community Thrift is also in the Mission District of uh, San Francisco. This next one is totally, totally 80s. It has a pop of green, which I love. And we got this one at, I'm not sure what the store was, but it was also in the Hay area of San Francisco. Um, they have a lot of good thrift stores there. The only thing is it's a little overpriced because it's like, I feel like thrifting is really popular in the city. So the thrift stores like take advantage and they price things like way more expensive. And this one was like 30 and you can wear it with like high waist jeans and like Air Force ones for that whole like 80s vibe which I love. Next thing I got is this blazer from Windsor. This one is also thrifted by the way. It's just like from Windsor but I think it's really nice. Blazers are really in right now so I wear this one. I wore this in my last Instagram post. Yeah it's really cute. I got it at also community thrift for like $8. Next thing is another 80s like jacket. It's like really oversized, also 80s vibe. And it has like the balloon sleeves, which I love. It's a really good piece. Oh, and this shirt actually, I think you guys saw this on my first vlog ever when me and Chris went to the to Hate Street to go thrift shopping. We went to Wasteland and he found this shirt. It says how much can I get away with and still go to heaven? Next thing, the piece that I'm most proud of, I can say that I thrifted this, is this Gucci like short sleeve sweatshirt material shirt. It's fake. A lot of people think it's real, but we got it at the thrift store for like 60 bucks. And something like this would go, if it was real, it would go for like 300 to 500 dollars. Like if it were real, I think that's what it would be worth. Well, we got it for sixty dollars, and I don't know. I just think it's really cool. I mean, I don't own any like real Gucci stuff. Like this is the only luxury piece that I own. Not really luxury, but you know what I mean. Next thing I got is also like '80s vibe. It's um this like leopard button up. We've only worn it a few times, like Chris has worn it once and I've worn it once. I think it's really cute and it has really thin material and it's very flowy. It's a really good piece as well, like an 80s piece. But yeah, this is a, another one of my favorites. 
My most favorite piece that I've ever thrifted is this Champion crew neck. And no, it doesn't look in very good shape because it's like kind of wrinkled, but I got this at Wasteland for about $30. And it's like this vintage Champion, like oversized crew neck. I wear this like so much. It's, I love it. It's so comfortable and I like how wide the neckline is. So it shows like my collarbones a little bit and then with my jewelry it looks so pretty next thing is these pants that i also got from buffalo exchange i actually haven't worn them yet this is one of my newer pieces it was only ten dollars and they're from h&m they're a size six they sit right where you need them to sit especially in the ankle area and if you wear them with like air forces they look great next thing i'm going to show you guys is this um vintage t-shirt chris actually bought this on his own it's a soul sister it's really oversized which i love i really like this one and it's not even mine it's chris's but it's like it's mine this bag is a nine west bag i don't know if that's an expensive brand but um i got this at community thrift for only like ten dollars cute tapatio when i went to the movies <laughs> um but yeah it's like a really nice bag and oh when i saw it i thought it was a fanny pack and i was like oh my god it's a fanny pack but it's not really a fanny pack but since the straps are so small i wear it like a fanny pack like this you can make the straps even a little bit smaller and i tried like adjusting it so that i can wear it on my waist as an actual fanny pack but the strap is like just way too big so I usually just wear it around my shoulder like this but it really does look like a fanny pack so that's why I love it because fanny packs are in right now everyone loves fanny packs anyways this is my next item it's super cute I usually just like hold it like this or like this too I feel so like I feel so like 2000s in this like with lip gloss on, my hoops, and like this bag. This one I also got at Community Thrift for like $8. Or less than that, maybe like 5 Last but not least, I have these Steve Madden lace-up booties that I got at Buffalo Exchange, also the one at Valencia, for only $20. And I wore these to the Magic Jordan concert. They, they're not like very comfortable looks over comfort right well that concludes my thrift haul i hope that you enjoyed it i hope that i inspired you to go to the thrift store because honestly you can find really really good stuff and don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram at yolanda in the city and i'll see you guys next time bye